If you're not a fan of notches on smartphones, well, we have good news for you. Following Oppo and Vivo, Xiaomi has also come with its all-screen smartphone design, which is this Mi Mix 3. How do they do it? Well, it's a slider phone. Now, Xiaomi has managed to achieve this all-screen design by first, shrinking the antenna design inside this chin. And secondly, this whole screen here is actually a slider. Now, the sliding mechanism here relies on a couple of magnetic sliders inside. And so far, I haven't had any issues with it. It feels snappy, responsive, and reliable. And according to Xiaomi, this should be good for up to around 300,000 clicks, which should be good for several years. Now, most importantly, on the front, you have a 6.39 inch Full HD Plus AMOLED display, which looks very nice. And once you slide down, you get to see the 24 megapixel front facing camera, along with its two megapixel assistive camera for some bokeh effects. Slide it back up, you're back to the screen. On the back, you get a pair of 12 megapixel cameras, one for wide angle shots and the other for telephoto. So it's basically the same camera module as the one on the Mi 8. So as you would expect from the premium Mi Mix family, this Mi Mix 3 is yet another flagship phone with flagship specs, featuring a Snapdragon 845 chipset with up to 10 gigabytes of RAM when that special edition comes out at the end of November. In terms of storage, you also get up to 256 gigabytes, which is pretty nice. Just like the rest of the Mi Mix family, you also get a ceramic body on the back of this Mi Mix 3, just to give you that premium touch as well as extra polishing, which goes great with this color in my opinion. Of course, there's also this blue version and the black version, but for me, I think the green one is the one to go for. In terms of build quality, there's very little to complain about right now. The phone feels great, sliding mechanism feels solid so far, and well, the colors here just look fantastic as well. Now, in terms of availability, I'm not exactly sure when you'll be seeing this outside of China, but if you do want to get the 10 gigabyte RAM version, just fly yourself out to China around the end of November and pay around 5,000 yuan. Obviously, we'll be giving the Mi Mix 3 a thorough review when we get hold of a review unit. Until then, stay tuned on Engadget.com.